days had gone by, but no one seems to be teaming to her, do you like it? No man seems to love her. They just swoon and idolize her, but never love her. Menaeus, maybe. Maybe the goddess Aphrodite had cursed her daughter. Everyone in the palace compared her daughter to Aphrodite. They adore and idolize her more than the goddess herself. Then I must go to Delphi to consult the oracle. There must be a way out of this mess. My lord, the oracle is here to see you. Pythia, oh my dear Pythia, your timing is perfect. Neleus, son of the others, I have the answer you seek. But are you brave enough to listen to what this old lady has to say? For the sake of my daughter, Princess of Apollo, I would do anything. Even if it means losing her? What do you mean? Let psychic courts be clad in mourning weeds and sat on rocks of yonder hill aloft. Her husband is no white of human seed, but serpent Zion fears as made it out, who flies with wings above in starry skies, and God subdue each thing with fear light. The gods themselves and powers that seem so wise, with mighty love be subject to his might. The river black and deadly floods of pain, and darkness ache as drought the hands lying. Is there no other way? All roads lead to the same destination, Nilius. One way or another, Psyche's destiny would be catch up on her. No matter how you would protect her from her fate, she would still be destined to marry that. Son. You gotta be kidding me. Last time I checked, war breaks loose in a 200 mile radius whenever I'm around. This is all Psyche's fault. Now where's that stubborn son of yours? When I get hold on him, he will be grounded in Erebus for 900 millennia. Well, stubborn seems to be a family thing, don't you think? Anyway, banishing him to the pits of Erebus won't do any good. He has always been your helper, that little love plan of yours. Would you rather have Antares as your helper these days? Oh, please! All he does is bowl up every time he hears about unrequited love. See what I mean? Though it's quite ironic for me to say this, but you've got to yield to your son. Fine! I give up! I yield! Eros, get your butt in here this instant! Oh, well, gotta go. So many wars, so little time. Ta-ta! You called mother? You heard me. I lift up my curse in that breath. Now move your lazy bomb and heat up the world with some love. That will be fine with me. Look, can you just forget this silly love infatuation of yours? When she finds out that you're a god, she would only love you because you're handsome and powerful. She will not see your kind and gentle heart. She will not know who I am. She will not see me at all. I can prove that she can love me for who I truly am. Go ahead and try my test. Let's see if this girl would pass your test. Situation. It hurts us to see you like this. No, Patty, help me, my dear sisters. I am happy that all of this would come to an end. My beauty is my curse. It brought the jealousy of heaven which brought a lock upon me. I must make this strike alone. Sorry, my daughter. I want to wish you good luck, but the circumstance permits me not to. Just be safe, my darling. 
Just be safe. Please, remember that I'm glad this cursed life would come to an end. Farewell, my fine family. All of this will be over. Who are... where are you? I am Zephyr, the West Wind. I was busy blowing some kites when I was called to pick you up. You were called to pick me up? How else were you planning to get to your new home? My new home? Yes, we're all you will see because of the man. Now we're here. Must leave you now, my lady. Hello? Is anyone here? Sovereign lady, all that you see is yours. We host voices you hear at your servants and shall obey all your commands with our utmost care and diligence. Supper awaits you in adjoining room when it pleases you to take seat there. Where are you? Why can I see you? It is ordered a soul. Welcome to my humble abode, Psyche, my wife. Who are you? Don't be afraid, Psyche. I won't hurt you. I'm here to prove my worth as your husband. But I cannot see you. You weren't meant to see me, to know me, Psyche. If you see me, perhaps you will fear me, perhaps adore me. But all I ask of you is just to love me. I would rather you would love me as an equal than adore me as a god. Just trust me. I will visit you each evening and you would come to know me even better. Good night, Psyche, and welcome home. Psyche seems to be solving your son's abode. She does really make a lovely wife for her son. You seem to have stopped you with my French after. Who said I've stopped? Having the god of war as my lover, and the goddess of wisdom and warfare as my relative, I am very much prepared for my revenge. You sure about that? I'm just feeding my time, and the scoundrel will have me sweet revenge. You seem to have a really good plan brewing, Aphrodite. But of course, it's not all of potions I know how to brew. Fancy devoting your plans to me? I will use your sisters against her. One way or another, that little brat would miss her sisters. And eventually, she would invite them to her new home. These two sisters, Phoebe and Procne, well, they married kings, but just the local ones. My son's home is more splendid than that of their husbands. They didn't eat on golden plates or drink over goblets adorned by the world's finest jewels. I will let them sip into their hearts. You have done every by means just for a girl. Quite a pity. A goddess going down in a mortal's level. I'm off to Arabic now. Oh, how I love to turn my tail into these things. Thank you.